Hey guys, so today I'm doing a Vanessa Hudgens makeup tutorial. So I asked you guys on Twitter to send me some of your favorite pictures of Vanessa and I got a bunch of them. So I chose some of my favorites and also some other trends that I've been seeing on her like Instagram and whenever she goes to award shows and stuff like that. And if you are interested, then keep on watching. <laughs> So Vanessa always has very dewy skin, so I'm going to start off with a light foundation that leaves a very dewy and glowing finish, and this is the MAC Face and Body Foundation. Then she also is very highlighted all the time, so I'm going in with my favorite um, concealer right now, and this is the NARS Creamy Concealer, and I'm putting this under my eyes in the inverted triangle, um, in between my eyebrows, my forehead, on the bridge of my nose, my cupid's bow, and my chin, and then I'm blending this out with a big foundation brush because I think it really blends in nicely to the skin, and then I'm just gonna set it with my favorite powder, and this is the Laura Mercier Secret Brightening Powder. For her bronzer and contour, again, it's very dewy all the time, so I'm going in with a cream bronzer, and this is by NYX, and it's the Tangzo, Tangzo, yeah, the Tango with bronzing sticks, and I'm going to contour my cheekbones with this, my temples, my jawline, and my nose, and since it's cream, it's going to be very dewy. She doesn't really wear blush a lot, so I'm just gonna go in with the Sunbeam Highlighter by Benefit to highlight my cheekbones. As for eyes, I first start off with my eyebrows because they are the most important part of makeup. People don't understand that, they are so important. So I first start off with an angled brush and then I go in with this little tiny eyeliner brush and I use this for the front of my brow to make small little strokes because her brows go in a bit farther than mine do. So um, if I use like the angled brush, they look really blocky, but when I use this small brush like this, it looks like actual hairs. So that's what I use for my brows now. I'm now going to carve out my brows using some concealer and this is just one by MAC but you guys can use the same one that you use for your highlighting. I just felt like trying out this concealer. <laughs> As for priming my eyes, I'm using Soft Ochre Paint Pot by MAC and I'm applying this with a brush as opposed to my fingers because I like the finish of it a lot more. For eyeshadow, I'm taking this Revlon palette and taking like a gray blue kind of color and then with a big fluffy blending brush, I'm going to be applying this into the hollow of my crease. Now at first I didn't like this at all but after I kept blending it, it kind of grew on me so just work with it and then it will happen. Now I'm taking my Stila in the Light palette and taking this like sparkly gray color. It's really pretty. And I'm gonna put this on the outer V of my crease and then blend it onto my lid just a little bit. And then I'm also gonna put this on my lower lash line and this will give like a really effortless smoky look. And it's kind of like an everyday smoky eye but it's not too over the top. It's just really pretty and like sultry and I really like it. I'm then taking the lightest color in that palette and putting this on my lower lash line to help blend that in a little bit to my skin and also underneath my brow to finish off the look. For liner, I'm going to be rimming my waterline with the NARS Larger Than Life Eyeliner in Via Vinito. And then taking this small, stiff um, smudge brush, I'm going to smudge this onto my lower lash line. I'm then going to line my upper lash line with the Stila Stay All Day, and I'm not winging this out because in the picture she doesn't wing her eyeliner out, um, it's just her lashes that are very big and elongated, but if you want to wing this out, you can do whatever you pretty much want. I'm then taking some black eyeshadow and that same brush and just smudging out the outer third of the upper lash line. Now I'm going to apply my mascara and I always start off with my lower lashes. So this is the Clinique Stay All Day Bottom Lash Mascara and this is also waterproof so it doesn't transfer and it's awesome. And then I'm gonna move to my upper lashes and use my favorite mascara ever and this is the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. Now that the eyes are finished, I'm gonna move on to the lips and I first apply this Tom Ford lipstick. It's just a light nude pink. And then after that, I'm gonna go in with a little bit of this lip liner by NYX and I think it's in pink beige.
So thank you guys so much for watching and if you enjoyed be sure to give it a thumbs up so I know to do more celebrity inspired makeup tutorials. Also be sure to stay updated with me in between each upload which is every Thursday and Sunday by following me on my social media links such as Twitter, Tumblr, Instagram, and like my Facebook page. They are all linked down below as always. Also don't forget to subscribe so you guys don't miss another video and I'll talk to you in my next one. Bye!